Hello guys, welcome to Neurology 2 Minutes Concept and our topic today is Cerebrum. Our cerebrum is the largest part of our brain and it is made up of two cerebral hemispheres. As I previously told you that cerebrum is divided into two cerebral hemisphere. So it is divided with the help of medial longitudinal fissure. So medial longitudinal fissure divide the cerebrum into two cerebral hemispheres. Falk cerebri is a layer of the dura matter which is situated in the medial longitudinal fissure. Medial longitudinal fissure divide the two cerebral hemisphere. And the corpus callosum is a structure which attach the two cerebral hemisphere with one another. As I already told you that corpus callosum connect the two cerebral hemisphere with one another. It consists of four parts. The genome which is towards the frontal lobe. The rostrum which show bird beak appearance. The splenium which is towards the cerebellum. And the body which is the part between the genome and the splenium. Our cerebrum is composed of gray matter from the outside and white matter from the inside. During our embryogenesis, the prosencephalon form forebrain, the mesencephalon midbrain and the rhombencephalon hindbrain. The prosencephalon is further divided into telencephalon and diencephalon. Telencephalon form the cerebrum and the diencephalon form thalamus, hypothalamus and optic vesicle. Each cerebral hemisphere or cerebral cortex are divided into four lobes. The frontal, the parietal, the temporal and the occipital. Frontal lobe gets separated from the parietal lobe with the help of central sulcus. And the temporal lobe is separated from frontal and parietal with the help of lateral sulcus. 